I just spent five fucking hours doing this. Pointless call to action. But hold it, stop. Before I can show you the attempts that spent five hours, I should start off by showing you my first two attempts, because there were two attempts before this. Roll the clips. A slime. Oh, holy crap! Uh, get away from me, get away from me. Ah, uh, save me, dude. I don't know your name, but save me. Uh, ow, you're not supposed to shoot them into me! Okay, I'm at one health. I'm okay. What in the ever-loving hell is that thing? Do I... Do I just, like, stab it from a distance? Okay, uh, apparently I can't do that. Good to know. I wish there was a getting wood achievement in this game. Or maybe there is and I didn't notice it. Either way, it doesn't exist to me, apparently. What in the ever-loving hell are you? Holy crap, I only do one damage to that thing. This is the part where we back away quite quickly. Why is that thing flying? Person I don't know the name of. Now is not the time to piss off the slime while there's a giant red thing flying around my face. I feel like we should focus on delegation. Okay. And I'm dead. Well, that was an incredible run. Time for the hardest part of this speed run. Starting the timer. Crap, I forgot to delete this guy. We're just gonna... Gone. And now, we will have... If I can decide a name. Uh, simply... 0.1. Or just point 0.1, actually. 0.1 makes too much sense. Okay. I like how the biggest time loss so far is the fact that this game has been loading for three minutes now. Absolutely incredible. Ah, uh, I love how the power of editing can make everything that just happened in the last few minutes seem like it didn't even exist. Okay, now who the hell am I dealing with this time? You know what? From now on, your name is Jeb. Great job. Alright, from what I've learned, every single time I make myself a house, that idiot kills me. What did I call him again? Jerry? Um, basically, yeah, no, he's just gonna rob my house. So I'm gonna purposefully make this... The worst place to live in on planet Earth. You are going to be living alone in an empty shack in the middle of the woods with a bunch of evil slime things which knock out a fifth of your health bar. I hope you're happy with your life choices. Alright, now it is time to go over the plan. Make sure to add a little ding noise and have a little text box in the top left to show the plan. Great job. Alright, now, here is the plan. Number one, we are going to play super defensively. We are not going to leave the house at night. We are not going to do any exploring. I say while I'm exploring. We're going to ignore that factor. And most importantly, we are not going to enter caves. Oh, wait, hold up. There's a, there's a couple pods here. Just, we're we're going to break rule number three for a second. Actually, you know what? Rule number three doesn't exist. I'm going to explore this cave. Uh, just, just completely throw out the plane. The plan is no longer... The plan is completely useless. It no longer has a point. You know, I'm starting to feel bad for these slimes. Like, are these things sentient? I mean, they're moving, so you'd assume that they're sentient. Are these things alive? Am I killing living creatures? Why am I thinking about this waste? Wait, the, the, they're fucking slimes. What am I doing here? Do I get- do I, like, have a mental breakdown whenever I kill a slime in Minecraft? Then why the hell am I having a mental breakdown for killing slimes here? That's my point. I shouldn't be. Okay, and they're killing me. I no longer feel any remorse. Die. Alright, I've got a genius idea to kill those zombies. Alright, hear me out. That was a terrible idea. That was an absolutely ter- How did you survive that completely unscathed? This is the content that people come to YouTube to watch. Some kid hitting a bunch of zombies with a wooden sword repeatedly in a game that is not Minecraft. What is my life coming to? Cactuses. I swear to god if I can turn this into armor, that is gonna be the stupidest thing I've seen all day. Yes. 
by far the best possible. Magic set. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I look so stylish. <laughs> ah. Hello, slime. It seems that we've reached the point of negotiation. Sorry, I, I'm I'm trying to negotiate with one slime. Okay, I guess I can ne negotiate with both. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to kill one of you. It's a lot harder to negotiate with two people than it is one person, so I'm just going to kill one person. Anyways, uh, we were talking about... I don't really know how to negotiate with slime. Hmm. Editor me here. Just wanted to point out that I was in this mine for a good period of time attempting to get basic resources. And, uh, I can't really use any of this footage because it's all mostly boring. So, I'm just shoving it in here to point out that it did happen so that I don't feel like it was all for waste. Well, would you look at that? A minecart system. Interesting. And I like, oh my god, I already have a minecart on me. I don't remember making this. Unless it materialized out of thin air. Which, honestly, would not be the weirdest thing to come from this game. Um. Wow, this is an insanely slow and strangely boring ride. Did I just see a magic cart? What is this game? Why- why is there a, a magic fairy? Hello? What- why- why are you here? What- what do you want me- why are you taking me in this direction? Uh-huh. Oh, it's another one of those weird heart things. Okay. Why did a magic pink fairy just point me in the direction of a heart. Is, is it gonna, like, give me extra life? Is this how you summon giant eyeball guy? If so, that is... exceptionally strange. I'm not sure how a magical heart is going to give me the power of life itself. Another one! Are you gonna take me to a, a new heart as well? Where, where are you gonna take me, bud? Where am I going? Okay, yes, it does increase my life. Now, where are we going? Okay, well, that fairy died in vain. Oh, come on, Jimmy! Why did you leave- Why did you let a giant blue umbrella slime into the house? I told you that you can't have pets. No, I didn't tell you that. You can't have pets. God, mark my words, later in this game, there is going to be some mixed human, mixed animal, furry thing. And then I'm going to have to make some kind of terrible re joke related to it. And I don't know where I'm going to go with that. Why has it suddenly got red all of a sudden? Is this what I get for predicting the future? You can't hide the truth, game, no matter how much you want to hide it. There is probably going to be something very, very bad showing up soon. Okay, there's a bunch of eyeballs. Is this the Eye of Cthulhu? Do I just have to kill one of these things and I beat the game? Am I about to speedrun this game? Am I about to become the world's best Terraria speedrunner? This is probably not the giant eyeball that they're talking about, but... I I I'm gonna pretend that it is for like 15 seconds. God, this is some ripping gameplay. Skip. God, don't you love it when monsters can't break a single block of dirt and you can just hide in your house the entire night? That is some riveting gameplay, folks. Apparently, from what I've been told by Carol over there, something, something, a bunch of people will show up if I build them housing blocks. So I'm going to build them, by far, the worst possible housing so that they can sell me stuff. Capitalism, folks. This message was brought to you by the Soviet Union, who came back only for this joke. You know, Porky, I'm starting to wonder, are there other bees in this game? And is it seriously... Did, did the world turn red a second time in a row? Is this going to become a consistent occurrence? Is it just every single night after I made that one bad joke? It's not even a joke. It's just a statement. Because I know for a fact that there is going to be something related to that. And then I'm going to probably be very confused for a long period. And I'm not going to directly point out what it is, so that if people jump to this point, they're going to be extremely confused, and then restart the entire video just to find out what I'm talking about. This is what I like to call getting watch time.
Hi, I have no idea who you are, I have no idea how you got up here since there's no ladder, but taxation starts at about six trillion dollars, so I'm gonna expect to be paid on a hourly basis. You know what, I'm gonna take that, and I'm gonna get this money back later, so it doesn't matter. That That's... That's 100% how this is going to work. The random NPC is 100% going to listen to somebody. Have I always had a grappling hook? I no longer remember if I've always had a grappling hook. Ever since I found out that I apparently have a grappling hook this whole time, I, I, I can now traverse. Okay, what the hell is this? Why is there just a house in the underground? Is... Is this what happens with climate change? Do houses just start falling into the ground? If so, this is the, I don't know what to say anymore. Oh, what is this? Double jump. Did climate change cause me the... Has climate change given me the ability to double jump as well? Because if so, I have very mixed feelings about the last 20 seconds. Why is this entire bus room? I, I tried to say biome and mushroom at the same time, but I just ended up with bus room. I don't think there are any bushes here. And even then, I've still said bush wrong. Like, am I boshing? I don't even know what that word means. I'm not British. I don't know what to say anymore. I'm just making terrible jokes back to back to back to back to back. I just need I just need to stop talking for a second. This game, wow, so many housing units. So many. I, I'm, I'm stalling for time. I don't know what to say anymore. I'm, I'm just... I'm just kind of trying to think of things that I might possibly- Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Don't worry. About a thing. Just don't go down one floor. Because if you do, there's like a 70% chance that you're gonna make like 60 Terrible jokes, which will get you demonetized, please. Oh, shit, I don't have a way to go back down without going down the floor. How do I get down? How how do I do- Real quick before- Oh my god! Why did I do that? Why did I do that? No, no. We're cutting that joke out, right? Right? Oh god, I'm not gonna cut that out, am I? Oh. And then multiple hours of footage got corrupted. Fuck. Now I'm just waiting for a giant eyeball to show up. Because it is supposed to show up, right? Like, I've done an intense amount of grinding. Maybe I need to, like... Uh, I'm just kind of tired. How, how, no, seriously, how long does it take for the giant eyeball to show up? Because, like, I, I'm not going to want to do this for very much longer. Like, you can have my attention for maybe, like, ten more minutes? You got ten minutes, game. Uh, oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh sh- oh 